Hey everybody, um, it's Julie Johnson. I'm um, one of the I'm one of the heads of um, Integrate. Um, I am the founder. I'm a um, trauma informed public educator and also a person who also has a diagnosis of um, CPTSD, complex PTSD. <laughs> so I'm on both sides of the of the various people that we serve. So anyway, um, I wanted to get on here really quickly. I'm on here a little earlier because um, uh, I am parenting today and so we have things to do. So, but I wanted to make sure to get on here to explain. Um, hi BJ, thanks for coming on. Um, <clears throat> uh, I wanted to get on here to explain the uh, um, mem that we created of the, how to find a, trauma-focused psychotherapist. Um, we have, it's come to our attention and we've been watching this for as long as Integrate has been doing things, which is almost um, three years. Um, <laughs> we just wanted to talk about how to find a trauma-focused psychotherapist because it's really important as um, the increase of suicide ideation seems to be increasing um, with the domino effect of, um, of the impact of um, what's Kate Spade and Anthony Bourdain and the very traumatizing um, world we live in today. <laughs> um, I just wanted to make sure that we are doing some psychoeducation on how to find the right therapy because it came to our attention, like I said yesterday, with many people responding to our story, our Instagram story, that there are people that are going to what they think are trauma-informed therapists to find out that um, through the therapy process that they are not. So I'm not a therapist. I have gone through this process as a non-clinician. <laughs> so I feel like I can bring a little bit of extra um, perspective in this since I have been on the consumer side of trauma healing and being a trauma-informed professional. So um, I'm coming at it from that angle, whereas Victoria comes on here as a clinician. I'm gonna come on here as a consumer. I had to look through this from that perspective. Um, so really the important piece is is understanding the types of therapy to look for so um just because someone says they're trauma-informed does not mean that they're trauma-informed okay At the more that we go into this sort of wanting to come into mainstream which we do but it does mean that there are wolves in sheep's clothing as we've found so that just means that we need to be a little bit more um intentional and understanding um, about the sort of mental health therapy that we go uh, that we're shopping for. So um, in saying that, um, the best thing I can say is if you can't find anyone on our list, okay, because we go through a really special uh, process to get our professionals on our list, then I want to tell you about how to get on to how to use psychotherapy or sorry, psychology.com or psychologytoday.com. I'm sorry. Um, so in the mem, I said, um, you're going to go to the website and actually, you know what I'm going to do? I'm actually, and if you have any questions, feel free to, um, comment cause I am watching those. Um, I'm going to go to the website and I will show you how to go about it on the desktop. Okay. So I'm going to turn this around so you guys can see my, um, my computer. I should have just had that up and going. Um, sorry about that guys. Um, I'm gonna turn this around so you guys can see my <clears throat> We're getting there, sorry guys. Okay, so here's the Psychology Today website. Okay, so here's where you see find a therapist, okay? You're gonna go in here and I'm in, I don't know, let's say we're in, I don't know, I'm in, I'm, I, my zip code is, uh, we'll see, I'm in St. Louis. So I'll put in um, St. Louis um, and it'll come up. Let's see, go to search. Okay, so here's just the St. Louis therapist. This isn't good enough, you guys. We have, then you need to go over here and you need to scroll down in the left-hand corner and you see where it says, I'm gonna go up here. It says issues, sexuality, gender, age, language, types of therapy. This is where we want it, right here, okay? Okay, you're gonna wanna expand. You're gonna press the more button, okay? And then it goes down to all the different types of therapy. It goes to brain spotting, coaching, cognitive behavioral therapy, compassion focused. So really what you want to see is you want to look at people who do EMDR because you're going to go up here to the E's. EMDR is one type of therapy that almost anyone who's trained under that is um, 
trauma focused, okay? So these are the people in our area that are, um, that would be, there's a couple of you I know I see on here um, that are on our list um, that are trauma focused. Okay, so let's say, okay, EMDR, you wanna look at someone else. So let's look at someone else. So let's look at um, internal family systems is another type of trauma focused therapy, which means anyone trained in that specific type of therapy um, will most likely be truly trauma focused, okay? And not just using buzzwords. Okay, so let's look at internal family systems. Where are you? Hold on a second. It's hard to look at through my thing. Um, internal family systems. I don't know. It was on here the other day. I don't know sure where it is. Okay. Anyway, it is on here somewhere. Internal family systems or psychodynamic is uh, is on here, hopefully. Um, or you can always, if you can't find it, you can always go up here and write it in if you want to. It says trauma and PC, PT, PTSD on here as well. Sometimes that's few and far between, but one way to figure it out is you can go to each, each um, therapist. Let's go to the, this girl's website. And you can look under their treatment methodologies, okay? And over here, it's on the right-hand side. So she does EMDR, okay? and she does mindfulness-based and she's trauma-focused. So it tells me that this particular girl probably is trauma-focused because she has that EMDR background she, and she says she's trauma-focused as well and she does interpersonal. So that type of therapy is really important. Um, now I know that they do have psychodynamic and internal family systems on here. I'm just, probably I'm just not focused on it because I'm talking about it at the same time, but it is on here. Um, another one you can look at is, um, that is almost always is, um, where is it? It's not just the trauma one. It would be attachment based is the other one that's almost always, um, although these are issues. That's why I can't find it. Sorry about that. <laughs> you're going to want to go make sure that you're on the types of therapy. That's why I couldn't find it. Okay. Internal family systems. There we go. Make sure you're under the types of therapy, not the issues. Okay. I'm glad I said that. Okay, so here's all of our internal family systems people that have gone had that have had internal family systems therapy training. Okay, so anyway, so make sure you're under the types of therapy. So internal family systems, psychodynamic, um, hip some hypnotherapists are, um, and then you'll see some therapists. Oh, somatics too. Let's see where's our somatics. Sand play. That's sometimes some play therapists. The trauma-focused therapists, like I said, sometimes they just put that in there because they have some background in trauma. They might be trauma-aware, but they may not be trauma-informed, which means when you come across certain um, certain issues in psychotherapy, like forgiveness, for the, for example, um, they might tell you you might need to forgive your abuser. You know, so that's where that being trauma-aware isn't enough when we're talking about the issues to help us process trauma. So once again, in in review, EMDR, psychodynamic therapy, internal family systems, attachment. Those are all the um, types of therapy that we are going to want to look at to help you. Um, there's attachment based. There they are. Um, that's going to help you process the trauma and um, make sure that um, you're getting a trauma focused therapist. So um, again, like I said, you just need to be a really smart consumer. Just because someone says they're trauma-informed or an organization says they're trauma-informed does not necessarily mean they're trauma-informed. And sometimes, as the more this information gets out, we will see people that are causing harm to take on that role. So um, just make sure where you're um, being a uh, smart consumer of mental health therapists and that you're looking for, um, again, because I cannot repeat it enough, therapists that have had the correct training. And you can see that on psychologytoday.com. You're looking at therapists who have either had EMDR training and or are all of the above, if even better, attachment-based, internal family systems. Um, I don't think they have trauma-based trauma CBT on here. And what was the other one? Biofeedback is one that's on here too. That's a great one. Biofeedback is huge. And psychodynamic. Okay, so those, anyone that's had those six is like, it's probably doing pretty good. But saying they're trauma focused is not enough. <laughs> You're going to want to see probably one to two of those criteria to um, determine if they're going to be um, worth your money. So and time. Um, anyway, you guys, thank you so much. Um, I will hopefully um, be on here continuing on this thing and hopefully um, 
Victoria can help you, um, can help us kind of hash this out from the clinician side as well. All right, thanks everyone, bye.